After a month of looking up in this path, this pass from Canmore, finally up here. Woo! On the fat bike! Got my pack and my skis there. Uh, feeling good. It was really hot coming up here. I had to strip down, but now it's, uh, it's pretty cold right here in the pass because the wind's funneling right through. Awesome time down in Canmore. I uh, can't wait to come back. Thank you, Canmore. Now I head that way. Yeah. Uh, this is uh, a bit tougher than I thought it was going to be. But uh, I'm getting close, I think. I've been going for, biking for almost four hours now from Canmore. And uh, having this weight of the skis, stuff on my back. Uh, Actually, more importantly, on my butt. It's not super comfy. It's just a lot of weight coming down on a not so wide, comfy seat. Otherwise, okay. Feeling a little bit of pain in my knees. Mostly because I can't put the seat any higher. But yeah, all's good. Ah! I just left uh, my fat bike at Mount Engadine Lodge and somebody there is thankfully driving it back into Canmore for me to give it back to Shannon. And I am now on my skis. Finally skiing west towards Vancouver. Feeling stoked. Uh, this is gonna be amazing. And it's gonna be an interesting night tonight as I try to start a fire under a tree in order to cook my dinner because I do not have a stove. I'm going so lightweight as you can tell my back is not very big. It's quite nice and light which means I can make distance. So uh, it's gonna be interesting. It's gonna be fun and it is dead quiet out here. It's absolutely beautiful. Just beautiful. First night out on skis. This is my camp set up here. It's pretty sweet. I got a fire going, cooked my meal on it, dug it out a bit. Had all the firewood right here under the tree. It's been pretty sweet. Um, a bit concerned because the wind direction is sort of blowing a bit of sparks onto my bivy. So I've just killed down the fire a bit, but. Should be a pretty good sleep. Yeah, I did the bike from Canmore up to Engadine. It was about 37K. And then I think I skied maybe 15K after that in maybe about two hours, something like that. Anyways, got the forest to myself right now. And I actually didn't have to break trail because somebody else had uh, broken trail up to this point. So uh, feeling pretty good. 
Um, yeah, gonna go to sleep now, I think. Yeah. <laughs> uh, but, uh, I don't know, it was beautiful. I finally, you know, got up into the mountains. It's crazy having spent so much time in Camor not actually getting too high up in the mountains, which is what usually what I first do when I come to the Rockies is climb up a peak. Um, didn't do that. And uh, feeling pretty good. I'm uh, gonna sleep well tonight. Peace, guys. Made it up to the pass here. I just want to say thank you to Canmore. Thank you, Switching Gear. Thank you, Valhalla Pure. Thank you, Rebound Cycles. Thank you, Shannon. Thank you, Kaylee. Thank you, Big C. Thank you, Alpine Edibles and Farm Box for all that good, delicious food. Thank you, Lawrence Grassy and Alpenglow. Thank you, Yoga Land. I'm gonna miss you guys. Look forward to seeing you again. Now, I head that way. Yeah.